everyone, this is Larry. Welcome back to Today I Feel Like. Today we are going to unbox the Hollyland Mars 400S Pro wireless transmission system. We're gonna unbox it, take a look at it, and then I'm going to do a full review later. But let's get to unboxing and check it out. And here we go. All right, before we get started, let me just tell you, I have seen a number of videos on the Hollyland Mars 400S Pro, and people cover it for different reasons. Some people cover it for the wireless transmission, some people cover it for the live streaming abilities that you can do with it. But what I haven't actually seen is just a simple unboxing of the product. So I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it today, and then I'm gonna use it and come back and do a full review later and talk about some of the features. So let's go ahead and unbox this thing. And first things up, let's just take a look at the, uh, let's just take a look around here. We can see it says Hollyland for a better view. And we can see it says this is the Pro version and this is the Mars 400S Pro. We are going to get 400 feet of HDMI plus SDI wireless transmission. That's just bananas, 400 feet. That's just, yeah. That's, I mean, I can't imagine filming 400 feet away. And yeah, I mean, maybe you can, or maybe you need to. I can't imagine why you would, but yeah. So anyways, um, we can take a look on this side. It just says a little bit of branding there. Um, some FCC, uh, I believe it is, um, viol uh, violation, FCC uh, information there with the numbers that they have. Uh, Mars 400S Pro and a little bit of uh, Hollyview right there and then reliable wireless experience. And yeah, so on the back, there's really not much there, uh, UPC symbols. So, all right, let's go ahead and just uh, cut through this plastic there so that we can... Uh, we can get through this and take a look at what it's gonna, what this device is actually gonna look like here. So we can kind of see what it's gonna look like on the front there, but I wanna see it in person as I'm sure so do you. So there we go, we're gonna get that, the box is gonna come up. We're gonna get it off. There we go, it's, oh, there we go. All right, very nice. So first things first, we're gonna get an after sales card. So if we have any issues, we can give them a call and, uh, and get in touch. So if we have any support issues, we can do that. That's always very, very nice to see. These are so uh, very important because oftentimes people have issues with their devices and they don't know who to reach out to. Some, I mean, if you didn't buy your product from uh, a local retailer or something, sometimes people are unsure of how to reach the, the company for support. So having an after sales card is just something that's very simple and also very, very helpful. So, all right, we have the uh, the Mars 400S Pro user manual here, and uh, it's gonna give us some ideas of typical setups and product interfaces and uh, give us some ideas of how we can use this product. So yeah, that's gonna be useful. So we'll set that off to the side and straight up right here, we can see uh, the two products. And one thing that I see on here that's very, very cool, because if you notice, they look almost identical here in the in the packaging. But one is a receiver and one is a transmitter. And I'm gonna take both of these out right quick. And you'll see here, they look pretty much identical. They have the same setup on the sides with the SDI out. They have the same setup on the back with the uh, this here, I believe this is a heat sink on the, on the uh, back here and also a battery plate. We have the, uh, we have the USB-C port right there, the on off button and the HDMI out. We have that on both of them here and we also have the DC, uh, we have the DC in right there so that we can plug these in. Um, also on the top, we can see there, these are where the antennas are gonna go. So um, everything looks the same, but what isn't the same is right here on the bottom and that is the uh that is the locking uh the locking nub of the quarter 20 or excuse me the cold shoe mount there is a quarter 20 thread on the bottom there so you can uh screw those in but on the cold shoe mount you can see one is red and one is blue and so you're going to have the receiver is blue and the transmitter is red and this way you always know which one's which just visually you don't have to worry about trying to read which one is which or guess you always know just visually from looking at looking at it but on the front you will see here this one says transmitter this one says receiver so if you're ever unsure you can always read that too so all right there we go there we have them let me uh let me set those right there so we can uh let me just set those off a little bit and uh, we'll see what else we have in the box here. 
it looks like we're going to get the uh, the power cable. So as you saw, we can actually plug this in. So we can uh, we can plug this in for uh, for DC power, and it has a locking uh, it has a locking twist lock on there. So you don't have to worry about this getting pulled out if you're ever using this. So. If you're ever doing a live stream or some other, you're doing something else and you're running it strictly off the power and someone steps on your cable and drags it or something, you don't have to worry about it pulling out because this locking mechanism will help that uh, stay in place. So, and uh, it looks like we're gonna get, hopefully we're going to get a plug that goes on there because we don't have one there. And yes, we do. So here we go. It looks like we are going to get the US plug and that is going to twist. Let's see if we can get that in there. And there we go, twist right into place. And we can see there it has open and lock, and then there is a release button right there, so we can push that, and we can um, we can uh, release it and get that off. So yeah, very nice. I like that. So one thing that's really nice about this is that um, if you are if you are in the U.S. and then you go to say Europe or you go to uh, South America or Central America or somewhere else in the world to Asia, and you need a different lock, a different plug you can just order one of these and then you can get the plug that you need so that you don't have to worry about buying a whole new power brick. So, all right. Yeah. All right. Let's set that off over here. We'll just set that right there for the moment. See what else we have. These are going to be the antennas and it looks like we're going to get one, two, three, four, and it looks like there is a fifth one in here. Now there's only two on each device here. So, um, it looks like they gave us a fifth one, so in case something happens to one of the antennas, you can go ahead and replace the antenna um, on the spot. You don't have to worry about uh, having your device out of commission or having to go hurry up and buy a new one right quick. You can just go ahead and replace it and then get a new one later. So, yeah. So that looks like that is going to be everything that comes in the box. So it looks like we're going to get both a, uh, a, a receiver and a transmitter. We're going to get the um, we're going to get the DC power there that we can use for that. We're going to get uh, five antennas here that we can hook up. We're going to get the uh, we're going to get the user manual here. We'll set that right there, and we're going to get the after sales card that we can use as well. So yeah, lots and lots of cool stuff. And um, let me see. Let me just go ahead and uh, and just screw one of these antennas on. Actually, I'll put them both on. I'll screw that on on both of these so we can actually see what this is going to look like. So there we go. That's that. And we can actually rotate these however we need to so that if you want to, uh, you know, point one this way and point one that way, you can do that if you want to have, you know, puppy ears or something, or you can put one up if you want to have cute puppy ears, or you can put them both up if you want to have Doberman pincher ears. So yeah. <laughs> Anyways, there we have it. Um, and to take these off, you can just go ahead and unscrew them. So if you're putting this in your camera bag and you want to go ahead and unscrew them so that you don't uh, you don't break them or bend them or anything or uh, potentially damage them, you can always just go ahead and do that. So yeah. All right. Well, there we have it. That is the unboxing of the Hollyland uh, Mars 400S Pro wireless transmission system. And yeah, it looks like it's going to be pretty amazing. It's very, very robust. I do want to say that these things, like, I mean, this is all metal. The whole body, it's all metal construction. It really is just feeling very, very solid. Like this thing feels like it is going to just, you know, last and last and last. It feels like if you accidentally drop this or someone knocks over your, your uh, camera, you know, your tripod or something, or you, you fall, this is going to survive. So maybe not your camera, but your Mars 400S uh, system should survive just fine. Also, I did want to point out that these are, uh, that this battery plate is for uh, Sony MPF style batteries. So these are, those batteries have gotten to be pretty universal over the years. So um, if you already have, say, lights that run on those or um, any other type of device that runs on those, you can quickly and easily, uh, you know, use them interchangeably with your other devices that use Sony MPF style batteries. So, yeah, there you have it. Um, again, this is the uh, this is the Hollyland uh, Mars 400S wireless transmission system. It looks like it's going to be pretty cool, and uh, I'm looking forward to trying it out and seeing how um, I can use it in my day-to-day -day productions. And uh, yeah, so look for the review. All right, everyone, so there we have it. That is it. That is my unboxing of the Hollyland Mars 400S Pro 
wireless transmission system. And yeah, this is a very, very cool system. It's going to allow you to do very cool things. For instance, like uh, be able to hook up a monitor that feeds the the video output from your camera to that monitor and then you can hand it off to a director or a producer or a client or whoever else so that they don't have to look over your shoulder while you're filming. It's also going to allow you to, uh, to li wirelessly live stream. So if you are live streaming and you have your camera that uh, you normally have hooked up to say your computer, you can now go ahead, pick that camera up and move it around and go wherever. So if let's say you're live streaming an event, maybe you're live streaming uh, a wedding or a concert or a kid's play or whatever and you want to be able to share this with your friends and your family elsewhere and you want to be able to move and get angles and be free this is going to allow you to do that so all in all it looks like it's going to be pretty awesome and i cannot wait to get this review started so anyways this was just an unboxing i am going to leave a link to this product down below in the video description so that you can check it out i'm also going to leave links to my amazon page and my social media contacts so you can reach me elsewhere and I hope you enjoyed seeing this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and please subscribe to this channel and follow me on Instagram. And I am Larry with Today I Feel Like. Thanks for coming back to see me. Come back and see me soon. And until next time, love, peace, and hair grease. Peace.